Uh, hey, what's up, folks at home? So for this year's Halloween costume, I, I needed to make this toaster bounce around. But it doesn't do it yet. So we got to teach you what a solenoid is so that we can make our toaster have sweet moves. Ghostbusters toaster. So what you're going to need for this project is a toaster, three or four solenoids, a motor driver, an Arduino, and a hefty 12 volt power supply, and a Ghostbusters outfit. But I guess I'm going to have to change. A solenoid is an electromagnetic device found in more appliances and machines than you realize. When voltage is applied to the solenoid's winding, a magnetic field is generated. <laughs> solenoids are designed to concentrate this magnetic field along the interior of the winding, where the solenoid's actuator is located. This metal actuator, or plunger, is attracted to the magnetic field of the solenoid just how metal fillings are attracted to a bar magnet. It always moves into the winding and can push or pull loads by utilizing the plunger. A solenoid converts electrical energy into mechanical motion by means of a coiled wire and a movable plunger. It is a, it's essentially an it's a it's essentially an inductive load just like motors or relays. I created my own solenoid using a nail, some magnet wire, and a straw. A magnetic field is generated anytime current is flowing through a wire. A coiled wire creates a particularly strong magnetic field and can be used as an electromagnet. An electromagnet is only magnetic when current is flowing through the coil. When the drive voltage is removed, the wind, the cur the coil, the winding current reduces to zero, zero, and so does the intensity of the magnetic field. Except for something called residual magnetism. But a well-designed solenoid won't have much of that. Without any other force acting on the plunger, it will stay right where it is. That's why many solenoids incorporate a spring to return the plunger back to its original position. In our case, we use gravity to do that. The winding has a low resistance, so applying a voltage results in a high current. This means that solenoids can get hot fairly quickly, and some solenoids are intended to only be energized for very short periods of time. Got through that one. So don't power your solenoid and then walk away and forget about it. Mountain! I wonder. Ordinary household toaster. It responds to music, so we've been testing it out with some middle of the road type stuff. Look at that, look at those solenoids go! Yeah! You're my number one Christmas gift boutique item! Ah, uh, so thanks for checking it out, guys! Oh, oh, okay! Yo, love! Lifting me higher! Then I.